everyone, I'm Vail from Mike and Vail's Life, and today I just want to share with you the Grinch tree that I have put up in our office for the last three or four years. I just absolutely love this tree. Now, I started collecting items about a year or two before I even started trying to put the tree up, and I'm going to give you a closer look. I'm just giving you an overall look right now of all the different things that I have used. I do use a lot of, I've tried to use as many ornaments as I can find, but I just don't, I have not been able to really find a lot, so I've just used other things. And now I'm going to get the camera, and I'm going to give you a closer look of the different items that I have used. Now for my topper, I'm just using a plush, and I think that really turned out good. That was one that I purchased prior to even having the tree. I would wanted the tree, and I knew that he would make a good topper. Now, of course, I do have just regular little Hallmark ornaments, and here's one by Lennox. This is not an ornament at all. I got uh, this from a Hallmark store that was going out of business. They had three of them. I purchased all three. And this is something you would put in your refrigerator. And when you open the door, it would talk to you. I thought that was so cute. I bought, they had three. I purchased three. And I put a zip tie around his little neck and then hung him to the tree. And more plushes. Now this blue Grinch, I can't remember where I ordered that from, but I do remember that they had the Grinch in blue, which was supposed to be a limited edition, and they had him in green. And you could not pick out which one you wanted. I really was hoping I would get the green, but I got the blue. And I really, when I got it, I debated about even putting this on the tree. I've had it for at least two years, I think, maybe three. But I did decide to put it on the tree, and I thought, oh, I don't know what people are going to say. And the very first person that came in that looked at the tree said, Oh, my favorite is the Blue Grinch. So I have felt really good after that, and I'm very proud of the Blue Grinch. And like I said, I have, oh, this is Department 56, uh, Jim Shore, of course, Hallmark. Here's one that uh, my daughter-in-law's mom made me. And look how pretty that is. And another one of those refrigerator Grinches. I don't know what I don't know what they're called uh, as far as the you know what you put in your refrigerator, but just showing you. Got to go up, let you see another plush. Now, this was really the only place I have to put this tree. Uh, so, it's in a corner. So, I, I love looking at all of the ornaments and everything. So, I've really got everything crowded to the front. I didn't really realize just how crowded it was going to be this year. Uh, so I went ahead after it was put up. I just couldn't take it back down But next year I will be putting it on a rotary and that way I can divide this out And I think it would probably look a little better This one's facing. I love this. This is a little Jim Shore And you can put either naughty or nice
Now the only thing, <laughs> this has absolutely nothing to do with the Grinch, the little uh, airplane, but my boss, uh, he's a pilot. He, at one time he was even a um, aerobatic pilot, and I just seen the colors, thought it would look cute on the tree, so I, I got that. Now I just want to show you what's at the base of the tree. I have a Grinch that's standing up. He is so pretty. And then I have just a mug that my uh, daughter-in-law's mom made for me. She's a very, very talented lady. And I have a Merry Christmas uh, pillow. It's in black. I just thought it would look cute down there have a little bag that says coal, and once again, a jar that my daughter-in-law's mom made. And then around, I just got a feather boa and put around just to add a little more of the Grinch green. Well, I hope everyone's enjoyed. I really appreciate each and every one of you for stopping by to let me share this with you. I hope everybody has a great day, a wonderful week, and a magical Christmas. Bye-bye, and may God bless.